ew. Today I am going to be doing something very stupid and not very original, but sometimes you just gotta <laughs> do something that's been done a million times before. I was going to film a really fun video today that I came up with and I'm super excited for, but it didn't work out so I have to film it. I have to film it a different day, but I still wanted to film something today because I did my makeup and I'm not just gonna waste this face. <laughs> You know so today i'm going to be playing the game episode choose your story i know a lot of people have played this on youtube and you are probably sick of seeing it maybe you're not maybe you don't know what it is but i don't care whatever it's a game and i'm gonna be playing it today so i have the app downloaded and i'm gonna look through and pick a story real quick um no i want to do one with lots of drama and romance living with my crush when the hot new guy moves in with you can you keep your cool Ooh, I like that. Let's do that one. Episode one, the exchange student. I never expected to fall in love, especially with him. Let me take you back to the day when this whole mess started. I feel like I'm gonna be really good at this because I like reading. <laughs> the last day of summer, we have two cute little girls. Uh, they're not little, they have big boobs, so they're not little, they're older. Vera says, so when does your mystery exchange student get here? Please tell me it's a hunky Australian dude. <laughs> this is me, before I had any idea that this mystery student would change everything. So, what's your name? Sam, seriously? No. No. So, what's your name? Oh, what's my name? <laughs> should we enter? I have so many names. Should we say Nicole? Or should we just go with Kennedy? Um, let's do Nicole, because Kennedy is fucking boring. I just hate her. Oh, I get to change how I look. Episode stepping up their game. I didn't used to be able to do this. I am, what is, what is the palest option they have on here? <laughs> oh, that, yeah, I'm, I'm that, okay. This looks good. Wow, I'm so pale. <laughs> Eyes, let's go with those. Select a color, blue. Mouth, I like those ones. My lips aren't that big, but I can make them that big with lip liner, so shut up. Hair, let's, I like the diva curls. Even though that's like so not me, I like them, okay? Nose, I don't feel like changing it, I don't feel like changing the face, so let's just say this is perfect. <laughs> I'm a lazy bitch. Wow, that girl looks prettier than me. What did she do? I wish the exchange student was a guy. What a slut. Oh, that's me. Now that would make for a steamy year. That's actually something I would say though, so Nicole's right. You deserve to have some fun. You look amazing, by the way. And I'm not the only one who noticed. Who? Hmm, let me think. Only the one guy who's been chasing after you since you were like five. He was chasing after me since I was five? Pedophile. Should I like not say that? Yeah, I shouldn't. Eric? Eric with a K? Duh, I don't get why you don't go for it with him. I don't know, what if someone perfect comes along? Perfect doesn't exist, Nicole, idiot. What's more perfect than falling for your best friend? Oh my God, so boring. You're just like my mom. She's always trying to get me to date him. That's like my mom. My mom literally tells me that I need to find a boyfriend, so. Thanks mom, love you. Then your mom has great taste. And apparently so does Nikki. Who the fuck is Nikki? <gasps> She's prettier than me. No, she's not. Are we wearing the same bathing suit? Wow, Eric, you've changed so much this summer. Sorry, but I'm not into blonde, so Eric, not gonna happen. You look amazing. Nikki is the most popular girl in school. She's always after the hottest guys. Well, Nikki needs a better hairstyle, okay? Look at her hair. It literally looks like just one big split end. Ew, I hate looking at it. And most of the time, she gets what she wants. I love her, honestly. You're not still hanging out with Nicole, are you? You're way too sexy to be seen with her. <laughs> well, seems like you didn't change at all this summer, Nikki. Oh, Nikki just walked away. Left Eric in the dust. He looks pretty good now that his braces are off, huh? Um, I'm gonna say, but we're just friends. Like I said, blondes. Who do you want to date, your enemies? Actually, yes. <laughs> I have problems. Just go for it. Take a risk. Yeah, Nicole, you gotta take a risk. <sighs> Eric, you have no idea what we're talking about, do you? Nope, Marcus just sent me to come get you guys. Who's Marcus? Last swim of the day, everybody in the water. <laughs> Look at my face. Where do you think he was hiding that snorkel? <laughs> I've never seen the word snorkel written out before. <sighs> Go get me another snork juice. If you know what that's from, I love you. He does this every time. Why do we keep bringing him? Probably because Vera has a big crush on him. Shut up. 
seriously shut up hey vera it's fine you just gotta take a risk oh my god he did that of course and i did it maybe i'm eric <laughs> um what the f is this boy wearing wait is he naked they're just like a black square <laughs> over his pants the f way to leave me hanging bro <laughs> why am i the only pale one as much as i want to stick around for this i gotta go my exchange student is coming tonight is it a guy her name is amiko she's from japan sounds sexy is she hot it's not just about looks marcus almost as hot as vera so you're saying there's going to be two veras this year yes this is disgusting <laughs> okay romeo time to go sun is going down if you don't put pants on you're walking <laughs> oh he is naked <laughs> him really shut up look i won't push eric anymore but i know i should give him a chance so what are you waiting for a dark handsome stranger to show up at your door that is exactly what i'm waiting for vera okay why don't you go i don't know i'm just waiting to feel a spark you know well when do you feel a spark well wait what well when you do feel a spark don't let the moment pass great advice don't be like me with marcus act on it be a tiger um, tigers kill people, so you want me to kill Eric? <laughs> the way they laugh. So stupid. Is Amiko here already? It's not even six. I'm still in my bathing suit. One moment. Oh, I guess there was a knock on the door. Did I not read that part? <gasps> oh my god. And just like that, I felt more than a spark. I felt like I was struck by lightning. This was definitely not Amiko. Who the heck are you? Or I think you have the wrong house. Um, I'm gonna say who the heck are you? Um, who are you? <laughs> his for oh, what should his name be? I know all of you are probably screaming, Logan, name him Logan. No, we're not doing that. We're not embarking on that adventure journey. Um, I really like the name Charlie for a guy, so we're gonna call him Charlie. My name is Charlie. Oh, f I should have called him Harden from after. Oh, whatever, the moment's passed. I'm your exchange student. Why does she keep doing that? Excuse me? I love the outfit choice. Is this how you greet people in America? I hope he's from England. There has to be a mistake. I'm waiting for Amiko, a girl from Japan. Yeah, clearly I'm not a girl named Amiko. I mean, you never know nowadays, it's 2018. Do you want to design Charlie? Um, definitely. Honestly, he's kind of fine. I just want to change his shirt, but I don't think that's actually, maybe his hair. His hair could do, do with a little change. Oh, I kind of like the messy faux hawk. That's such a fuck boy hairstyle. <laughs> Look how white I can make him! <laughs> Why is that an option? Is he a fucking ghost? Toffee or caramel? I like caramel. I'm kind of rethinking the hair. Oh, I'm really having a hard time deciding. Why is this so hard for me? Ooh, I like the curly. Okay. Kind of looks like noodles, but I kind of like that. Eyebrows, nose. Let's maybe change the lips. <laughs> I'm sorry, but what is- who- what- what is that? Looks good. Okay, he looks perfect. I'm done. <laughs> mm, I kind of hate him. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> it's not just about looks. Listen, my dad signed me up for this thing last week. I've been on a plane for 18 hours from Australia. Charlie. Well, I could do an Australian accent when I read his voice, but I know I'm going to get dragged for it in the comments. So, I'm going to do it anyways. All I know is that this form says to come to this address and stay here for the next year. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. That's gonna get me so much hate, so no thanks. Let me see that. Well, you're in the right place, but where's Amiko? Do I look like an information guide? <laughs> well, I'm sorry I'm not dressed. I wasn't expecting to see you so soon. Scratch that. I wasn't expecting you at all. Life sure surprises you sometimes. Any chance I could lay down for a bit? I'm exhausted. Well, I was going to share with Amiko. Be a tiger, Nicole. Just like Vera said. He's hot. Is it okay if I crash in your room? Even just for tonight? <laughs> I, um, well, look, I don't know how, what this year is going to bring, but maybe this mix-up was meant to be. I don't know. Did he just, like, walk past me? Vera is right. I can't let this spark fade. I mean, he's a literal stranger, so. He's not even that cute, and I designed him, so that's saying something. Besides, if he's here for a, for a year, I might as well cozy up, right? Wait! Changed your mind? I'm so unattracted to him. I love to know, get to know you better. Wow, if I pay for it, I can heat things up and let him stay in your room. But realistically, I don't want to let him stay in my room. Like, he's 
something weird. I just met him. So say no and keep him downstairs. Sorry, I'm not spending money on this app. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. Hey, I'm a gentleman. You were just like begging me to sleep in my room, so I don't believe you. <laughs> I'm sure you are. Blankets are in the closet at the end of the hall. Shame, but I get it. Hot, mysterious stranger shouldn't sleep next to shouldn't sleep next to you. Did he just call himself hot and mysterious? That's disgusting. You sure talk highly about yourself. <laughs> get some sleep. First day of school tomorrow. I hate him. He's literally the worst. This guy smells like trouble. I thought it said this guy smells terrible. Bunch of girlies laughing. Did you hear about that sexy new exchange student? Ida says, duh, he was in my first period class. I could listen to him talk all day with that dreamy accent. How did Nicole get so lucky? Oh, this bitch is mad. I forget her name. Oh, there he is in his jean jacket. He looks cuter in a jean jacket, I will say that. Hey there. Oh, her name's Nikki. You look lost. Let me guess, you're that hot British exchange student Nicole won't stop talking about. Australia, not Britain. <laughs> I can't, I can't do it. Well, geography was never Nicole's forte. Has Nicole been talking about me? Can you blame her? You're a total smoke show. <laughs> hey, Charlie, I, oh, I see you guys have met. What the fuck am I wearing? I look like a prostitute. We were just talking about you. Did you need me for something, Nicole? Oh, no, I was just going to offer to give Charlie a tour of this school. Sweet. Who the f <laughs> Who is that? It's the principal. Oh, I better be nice. He is the principal. Ah, Charlie, welcome. I see you've met the wonderful and smart Nikki. Okay, I hate him already. Since you're so well acquainted, let's make her your official school tour guide. Principal Walsh? Oh my god. Guys, I was meant to play this game. That's my last name. Do you think this is my future husband? Wait, no. Actually, yes. If I had a future husband, he'd be taking my last name. Ouch. Principal Walsh, I'm happy to show Charlie around. Trust me, he'll be in very good hands. I bet your hands are really good, Nikki, because you probably have a lot of experience, don't you? And I don't, so. Perfect, Nikki. What a fantastic school spirit. First Eric and now Charlie. I have to do something. Keep up the good work, kids. Look at my face. Damn, I'm hot. I don't look like that. He's sleeping on your couch, like right in the living room. Yeah, there's nowhere else for him to sleep. And you're not even tempted at all? Not even a little? <sighs> what? He's hot. Wait, there he is. Um, flirting with Nikki? Ew, I hate him. He seems so gross. So, I'll bet you could use some study help after school. Yeah, things are really uh, hard right now. You disgusting pig boy. This is gross. Totally. Makes me want to puke. Does this girl ever give up? I hope so. Wait a minute. Do you have a crush on your exchange student? No, I just, I don't like Nikki, that's all. Be careful, Nicole. Something tells me this guy will be nothing but bad news for you. <sighs> Seriously, don't fall for a bad boy. He's not even bad. What a stereotype. If Eric found out, he'd be heartbroken. <sighs> Buzz buzz. Is it a beat? What is it? One new text from Eric. Honestly, at this point, I like Eric more. Maybe blondes aren't that bad. Eric, we need to talk. He's jelly jelly. Wait, was that the end of the first episode? Ooh. Should I play another one or should I end the video? I don't know. I can't decide if I should play another one or not. <laughs> I'm kind of having fun. All right, let's play another one. Episode two, Eric's party. Ooh, sounds like a good one. I love a good party. Nicole loves parties. Am I right? Charlie. Oh yeah, welcome to the gun show. Ew, he's the worst type of male. Holy cheesecake, he's topless. <laughs> Just got used to it. Imagine him as a cucumber or something. Um, cucumbers are f***ing hot, so that's not gonna work. Oh god, not a cucumber. <laughs> I have a feeling a 13 year old girl wrote this. Crap, I can't believe I just said that out loud. Oh God, he's approaching. I take it you haven't invented knocking in America? Um, I'm gonna say I don't have to knock. I don't have to knock, Charlie, it's my house. It's basic courtesy. My house, my rules. <laughs> I'm not here to give you a little peep show whenever you want one. Look, Nicole, staying in the living room is exhausting and I could really use a little time alone, you know? I laughed. I'm sure you could. Double standards, that's all I'm gonna say. I didn't mean it like that. We all know you wanna beat your meat, Charlie. I'm laying on my bed. Must find coffee. Hey, you're Nicole, right? 
I'm so, so happy I ran into you. I could say, leave me alone, nice to meet you, or sounds like you found the coffee. I'm gonna say nice to meet you, because I'm not a completely rude bitch. Nice to, so listen, Nicole, I need to ask you something. It's very important. Uh, I've seen you with the new guy, the exchange student. Are you friends or friends? Um, bitch, we're neither. I'm his host sister. Is he single? I mean, single in the American sense, not an Australian. Um, I'm gonna say totally single because I don't give a fuck about him. Wow, I can't believe that. My day is literally amazing. Lisa, you suck. So do you think you could put in a good word for me? Listen, I have a lot on my mind right now. Besides, I really don't talk to Charlie that much. Come on, I see you guys talk all the time. You're like a brother and sister. Ew. I'm gonna say, sorry, not my job. Sorry, not my job. You're on your own. Oh, all right, Nicole. I'll hit, you, I'll hit you up later and see if you've changed your mind. Okay, I hate her. She's annoying. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Nicole, talk to Charlie yet? Oh my god, again? What is wrong with her? Oh my- Ew! Is she coughing on me? Hey, Nicole, what did Charlie say? Oh my god, in the bathroom? Hey, Nicole, I saw you coming down the hall. I ran away. <laughs> Well, I guess this is my life now. These girls in this school are desperate and lonely, but who am I to talk? Nicole, finally, Eric, someone I want to see. So crazy how my opinion of him has changed. I'm glad I ran into you. We need to talk. Ew, he's so, like, something about his hair I just hate. It's about your exchange student. It's not what you think. Huh? What are you talking about? Uh, what are you talking about? Listen, I ran into Lisa and she, oh, phew. Yeah, I did too. She won't leave me alone, actually. She's into Charlie. I'm gonna say I don't want to talk about it. I really don't want to talk about it. I shouldn't care who Charlie dates. He's into Nikki anyway. Still, there's something about him. There's actually nothing about him. No worries. I'm just here to make your day a little bit better. Oh, Eric. On a happier note, Marcus and I are throwing the first party of the year tonight. Obviously, you're on the top of the guest list. That sounds really fun. Can I bring Charlie? Why? <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> I mean, not like that. I just feel like I have to, you know? Of course. I mean, he's new to the school and country and everything. We should really try to hang out with him more. Eric is so sweet. I just want to be a good host. You want to be a good hoe. I wonder if tonight will finally be a chance to get Marcus and Vera together. Do you have any ideas? I'll work on Marcus. You work on Vera. Gotta run. See you tonight. What do you think of this dress? You look amazing. Actually, sweetie, that's an ugly dress. Well, I'd better. Tonight's the night for me and Marcus. Well, that dress is not doing you any favors. No more games. I'm officially going to ask Marcus out at the party. And what about you? Eric and Charlie will be there. Don't remind me. Okay, your turn. Go try your dress on. I know they're gonna offer me like a really pretty one for 25 gems and then a really ugly one for free, so. Well, that is fucking hideous. Oh my god. Ew, she just winked. Honey, you look like a 50 year old. Nicole, you look incredible. Vera, you're a lying bitch. You have to get it. Here comes the bitch Nikki. Aw, Nicole, don't you know you can't dress up trash? Oh, excuse me? Oh, nothing. I'll see you at the party, girls. Good luck. You'll need it. What a bitch. <laughs> she came back to say, what was that? I said, what a bitch. Just to be clear, I'm talking about you. Uh, Nicole, please think about what you're doing. You know what, Nicole? Give me that dress. <laughs> um, is she trying to get me naked? Does she have a crush on me? Excuse me? That's the last one, and I want it for Eric's party. Besides, it's Charlie's favorite color. Nicole, are you really going to let Nikki take the dress from you? Um, yes, that dress is fucking ugly. Like, I don't want to embarrass myself. Give up the dress and hand the dress to Nikki. If you care so much, Nikki, it's yours. Well, what do you know? It does look better on me. Actually, it makes you look 10 times worse, so the joke's on you. See you at the party, girls. You already said that, bitch. Well, that could have gone better. Especially if you didn't let her walk all over you. I won't mind either. I feel bad. Thanks. You're a good friend. Actually, she's a terrible friend. She didn't even stand up for me. Let's get out of here. Ooh, in the car with Charlie. I wonder what they're listening to. Why am I so nervous? Gosh, he looks amazing tonight. Just so we're clear, I'm only driving because your mom asked me to. So you're sober tonight? Well, someone has to take care of you. Um, I can take care of myself. Sure you can. He's literally the worst. Why aren't you dressed up? I don't want to talk about it. Such a mysterious girl. <laughs> I sure am. I like to keep things casual, that's all. Yeah, and then we're gonna see the stupid bitch Nikki who's dressed up in some nasty red freaking corpse gown. So, uh, what's going on with you and Eric? I'm gonna say we're friends, that's it. I see, hence the casual attire. Sorry, honestly, I think it's good to have guys as friends. It's good that you've got him. Thanks for the tip. Look, even if I were jealous, which I'm not, 
Nothing can happen between you and me. I get sent back to Australia. Good, I don't want anything to happen between us. I guess you'd better be on your best behavior then. What, is he an animal? Something tells me that's going to be impossible. It's actually very possible. Oh, a bunch of kids dancing. It's a party, bitch. Well, we made it. Now, let's party. What the f did she just do? Your dance moves are just as dorky as you are. I'll take that as a compliment. It wasn't a compliment, Nicole. It was a, it was a very much an insult. Hey, is that Eric over there? Why is he staring at us like that? <sighs> oh, I get it. He's jealous. He has nothing to be jealous of. Agree to disagree. What does that mean? Sorry, I shouldn't flirt with you. So you are flirting. Look, I was serious about what I said in the car. Nothing can happen between us. I know, Charlie. Even being this close to you in public, it's wrong. I never took you for one to follow the rules. This relationship is escalating very quickly. They've literally had like two conversations and I thought he was into Nikki, so. Well, what about going somewhere more private? Charlie, I'll be on my best behavior, I promise. I guess there are no rules about getting to know each other better, right? Exactly, come on. Oh my fucking God, episode, you're the literal worst. Like I, I actually, this is, I actually want to go with him. I'm broke. Fuck. Mm. I'm sorry, you guys all probably hate me right now, but I'm poor. I don't have the money to spend on a freaking game. Say no and be a stick in the mud. That's what I would actually do in real life, though. I'd be too scared to go alone with him because he's terrifying. Charlie, we can't. Okay, well, I had to ask. Charlie! Hey, Nikki. See you later, I guess. Yeah, bye, bitch. Hey, girl. Are they dancing? Oh. I wish we had one of those dresses. I feel like such a slob. Speak for yourself. I look hot as fuck. Are you okay? You look sad. I think I just ruined stuff with Charlie. Yeah, I just saw him and Nikki together. Oh well, there will be more chances with him. So what's up? You seem off. Well, I have to tell you something. OMG, Vera, look behind you. Marcus is flirting with some girl. I know, that's what I came to tell you about. He's all over her. <laughs> Dramatic zoom in. Is that the end of the episode? That was a stupid place to end it. Mm, whatever. There you go. There's me playing episode. I thought it was really fun, honestly. But then again, I have no life. So I really like playing games like that because they make me feel like not such a loser. Actually, they make me feel like more of a loser than I already am. So anyways, um, let me know if you guys enjoyed it. If I should keep doing these, let me know because I really don't know if that was entertaining or not. Um, but personally, I like watching people play this game. So I don't know, just let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!